This is Rodney. He has ALS and can't speak. But with the help of his implant, he's able to send me a text message using only his brain. We're now at a period in medicine where lots of technology for the brain has shown a lot of potential, but we've had trouble getting into the brain in a, in a safe and scalable way. And so Synchron's vision was, how can we build technology using the natural highways, the blood vessels into the brain in a way that can solve problems that haven't previously been solvable. So the stentrode is a stent electrode. We, we took the concept of a stent in medicine. It's a technology that's delivered in through a catheter, through a tiny little break in the skin to get into the blood vessels. The first application of the stentrode is in the use of an implantable brain computer interface. If we can detect activity in the brain that is associated with the control of movement, then you could restore their ability to exert their free will, exert their volition in the world directly from